Okay, this update is kind of like special limited edition uh, DVDs that I got recently. The first one, All About Eve. This is a Cinema Reserve Steelbook edition. I love steelbooks. All About Eve is one of my favourites. I've got this, I've got a regular version of this, single disc. So I thought it was time to upgrade. This is a very nice set. All About Eve is a fantastic 19, it's 1950 um, year and it's Betty Davis I've seen there. It's also got Marilyn Monroe, she's not in it that much but she's in it. And it says the dialogue is scintillating, characters extraordinary, direction perfect and production as fine as anything 20th century Fox has turned out. And it won... I don't know how many Oscars it won. It won tons. Um, very nice two discs. And it's got this pull out. It's very cool. It like pulls out like this. And there's Marilyn Monroe. This camera's got character and actress information. There's Betty Davis, my favourite actress. It's a very nice booklet. Um, and it's got a bit about the Cinema Reserve still books. I've got one more coming so I was so impressed with this one so you'll find out which one that is next time. Yeah, it's one of my favourite films, so I had to get this edition, really. It's very nice. Next one is this pretty cool set. Spider-Man 2 uh, limited edition DVD gift set. Very thick. Believe it or not, $2.99 on HMV's website, so um, go and grab it if you haven't got Spider-Man 2. It's kind of tough. Okay, it's like this. I haven't unsealed that yet, but it's um two disc. So unfortunately that hasn't got a slip case because I've got the Spider Man one limited edition digipack. I got that when it first came out when I was sixteen, my sixteenth birthday. And it's got like a a C D some songs from the soundtrack. I think it was a HMV exclusive. And then it's got these postcard art card things. Very nice. Um, I didn't actually like Spider Man 2 very much. I thought it was not as good as the first, but hey. And this is a pretty cool kind of like artwork book showing like the comic designs and stuff what's it called comic book artist portfolio it's very cool and then this is concept screen concept to screen portfolio more nice artwork and this is probably the best part. Uh, the Amazing Spider-Man, like a mini comic. I do like comics. I haven't um, haven't read any in a while, but I, you know, I liked Runaways. It's a very good comic. If you're into comics. <laughs> um, like pretty cool so, and that's followed by Spider-Man Freddy and this is a um, limited edition Amazon exclusive cover it's a slipcase this is probably the best cover with Black Spidey um, it's still on Amazon quite cheap if you want that um, I haven't seen this one yet, I might watch it later. 
as I said, I was not very. Um, Spider-Man 2 disappointed me, so I don't really have high hopes for Spider-Man 3, especially as some people are saying 2 is better. But we'll see. Disc 1 and 2. And then it's got uh, the Blu-ray advertisement. And I think that's all, all Spider-Man adverts. <laughs> I really like that cover. So this one I got from America. It's Region One. I got it quite cheap, but it's Ray limited edition, like book style. Um, I think we've only got a one disc, maybe a two disc, but it's a basic edition over here. So I thought I'd see if there was any better versions. And there's this disc one. I'm hoping that's not flipper disc but it does look like one on the back it says 25 minutes um, added footage not in the theatrical version so maybe that's why I don't know and it's got some really cool pictures and um, stuff about Ray Charles and the movie production notes it's a really nice book really cool pictures and stuff and then disc 2, bonus features, and that's it really. It was a very good film, Ray. It made me cry. <laughs> so, it's that one. This one has to be one of my favourites. It's Pan's Labyrinth. And this is a Korean import. I've seen pictures around this on forums. And apparently it's a very good set, so I decided to get it. And this, it's like a book binder, comes off. As you can see from the side, it looks like a book. And it opens like so, and you have uh, a key. It's just, just like, it's quite thin, but it looks quite cool. And it's got Pan's Labyrinth, um, kind of like sketch storyboard book which is very cool and it is in English which is helpful um, and then this opens and you have disc one and disc two and that's pretty much it it's a nice it's a really nice feel as you can see it's shiny Pan's Labyrinth is a very good uh, film so um, ch check it out if you haven't seen it it's probably one of the best films of did it 2005 did it come out maybe it was 2006 yeah I think it was 2006 well in that case it was one of, definitely one of the best films um, of 2006 um, absolutely awesome so yeah check that out and this is a very nice set if you want to go all out and get that.